Hi, Phil Koplinski here with Practical Hab Keto. Just a short little quick video for you um, on put it, taking somebody down using something called a C-step, which is very common in karate and many martial arts where you're just swinging your foot like this. It's called a C-step, just like this, called a C-step. In our case, we're going to take it all the way back into what's called a horse stance. Now, uh, a little preliminary information to understand something about this is humans and how humans react. When I do seminars and stuff like that, I've, I've done this for many groups. I'll ask everybody in the group to come up and grab me. I'll hold an arm up and say, I want you to step forward and grab me. 99 out of 100, whatever hand they're grabbing you with or punching you with, that foot will be forward. Don't take my word for it. Try it. I even had them change hands. They say, grab me here, grab me there, and then they walk up. And whatever hand they're in using or punching or striking or grabbing with, that foot will be forward 99 out of 100 times, okay? So, what we're talking about now is using a C-step to take somebody uh, uh, down to the ground. So, let's say he's got this finger up in my face and he's blah, 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 and there it is. That foot's going to be coming forward, and I want to take him down. There's a lot of different ways we can go to this. I may take this hand out of the way here and then take this hand straight to his throat. And now I'm going to take this C-step here, and I'm going to put it right in between his feet. And when I see step this in, the back of my leg right here is actually making contact with his, and I'm in this bent position. So I got him by the throat here, and when I do this C-step, I take this, put this all the way in, and all I do is pop this knee, and bam, they're going to go. And they're going to go every single time. Every single time. I can be, I can be on the inside here and do the same thing. I'm going to hold his arm for him now, because now you, you can control this. So I C-step in and I take him down from the top and I can control him to some degree and maybe not bounce his head off the concrete at the same time, you know? Uh, you got to take some responsibility for that. So I want you to practice that with your partner, give it a shot. Step in, C-step it in. Now both of my legs are bent. Now I'm going to straighten this leg and it takes that leg right out from underneath him. Once I C-step in, I'm in this horse stance, I'm very stable. Pop that and they'll, they'll drop. I was teaching a, a bunch of guys that were a security force and they were, these were all big guys from Gold's Gym. And I showed them how to do that and they go, well, you can't do it again. And so I kept putting them on the ground. Nope, there was no way they could really stop it. So again, don't take my word for it. Give it a shot for yourself. Apply it to some of the hap keto techniques or whatever uh, art you're studying. Stick that sucker in there and pop that in the leg. Watch, start watching what's happening. So. Putting them down with a C-step, Phil Piplinski, Practical Hap Keto.